Gonna be a quick little tutorial here of how to use GIMP to open up and do some simple edits to EXR files, the open ER EXR format. Uh, right now we're using GIMP 2.10.30. Open up a file as the base file. And we're just gonna use the background. And these files are uncompressed, the ones that I'm working with right now. So, as far as the layers, we just have one layer right here. As far as the channels, we got the green, the red, green, blue, and alpha, which is important for the end result of this. Uh, the main thing through this edit is to do all of our edits right now and then export it as a PNG with four channels in it and the alpha channel being included in that. Uh, so, there's a couple ways of doing this. We're gonna go to the layers right now. We're just going to add a new layer. There's our new layer. Uh, we're going to open up another file. This will just open up the front bird. <coughs> so now we got this file opened up as a second file. We got our two files on the top. There's the black background. There's the bird. Oh, I'm just going to select everything right here. Click onto it. Control A. Control C to copy it. We'll come over here. Make sure you have the new layer selected. Control V pasting it. And then I'm sure there's shortcuts for this. I'm not fluent with GIMP. Uh, just right clicked on it as we got the pasted selection or the floating selection right here. And we want to anchor that down. And then now if you want to do edits to that, we'll just change the size. Where are we going to go here? Scale. Just scale it down, hit enter to set it. So that was one way. Uh, another way we'll import another image onto this is open as layers. The first one we did was just open. This time we're gonna open as a layer. Image file as a layer. We're just gonna go with this text right here. And as you notice, we got the background and we just have layer. And then this new one's gonna add it in as a new, new layer here. Uh, do the same thing with this, we can size it up a little bit. Size it, enter. So now, now we got three different layers here. You can toggle stuff on and off like normal. And the main result is it and the main result for this thing is to be able to export it as a PNG with all the channels into it. So we go down to export as select by file type. PNG. I just select this top one, PNG, type it in, it'll automatically come down to the PNG format. Hit export. <coughs> now, this is important right here. Uh, this needs to be ticked or checked. Save color values from transparent pixels. That has to have the check mark in it, the X into it. This, when you open it up, uh, I believe the automatic uh, pixel format is what's the default setting. You want to change that to 16 bit, 16 BPC, and then RGBA, red, green, blue, alpha. And then all the rest of this you can just leave as the same. And we're going to export it. All right, so our original. Uh, image we worked with if we go to the channels we see how it has all the four channels in here if we open up this new file that we just created whoop. Uh, there it is is background PNG open this up <coughs> and hopefully the same four channels will be in that so there's our edited version just to show you can control it there is a second image that we imported, and then this is the final one. There's only one single layer on it, the background, or just, and that's what we called it, the background. Uh, and then there's our channels right there. Red, green, blue, and alpha. So if you toggle on and off, you can kind of do a little, little, little play in here. And that pretty much wraps it up.